Hey guys, it's Francesca and welcome back to my channel. So, okay, ignore everything about this video because I'm like not in the best mood right now, actually. Um, basically, um, as you know, we went on a trip to Punta Cana and if you want to see that um, vlog, it's going to be up on Francesca and Leah. And um, yeah, so it was great. We were invited to the Nickelodeon Resort Hotel and we stayed there. It was fantastic and it was just an amazing vacation. Um, and then today, you know, we, we got home last night and today I sat down to do my makeup and um, I'm like, <laughs> where is it? Um, I looked through my entire carry-on right there. I made a mess everywhere. I looked through my entire bed. I looked in the car. I looked in my suitcase. I looked in my, um, like, downstairs. I looked everywhere. Like, everywhere that it could have possibly been in. Um, and I couldn't find my makeup bag. Um, I absolutely could not find it because I brought it with me in my carry-on. And I was like, okay, yeah, I'm just gonna, um, have it in my carry-on if I need to touch anything up on the plane or whatever. Um, but yeah um i was hanging out at the punta cana airport and i was like at my gate and i was playing with this cute little girl named tatum she was at the nick resorts um with us this is like their instagram um, my parents were talking to their parents and like i was just playing with her um with our stuffed animals and um i took my makeup bag out and i'm pretty sure i left it at that gate right there and then i went to the bathroom and then when i went back in line when i came back from the bathroom my parents were already in line to board so i'm like okay and you know my mom took my bag so i'm like okay i thought it was <laughs> i thought the makeup bag was in there um but it wasn't i left it at the gate um so and i just realized that like 10 seconds ago so this is not good actually because i literally just before the trip i restocked some products and pretty much everything in there was like brand new so it's not ideal that I left it there. Um, but right now, I mean, what can I do? I'm not going to fly back to Punta Cana just for my makeup bag. Um, <laughs> I'm just going to go to Target and <laughs> repurchase everything. So I thought I was just going to like, yeah, it's a very unfortunate event. But I just thought I would um, bring you along with me um, to see what new products I can get or something. Um, and just make the best out of a really bad situation. <laughs> This is the only thing that I had with me. So this is um, my makeup bag that I packed like my skincare stuff. And this was in my um, actual luggage. Um, so here I just literally just have like skincare travel stuff. The only thing I have makeup related is my beauty blender. So and then this was loose in my um, luggage. So this is the only stuff like I have um, saved. Um, this is where I kept all my makeup. Here was like random stuff. I actually have no idea what I kept in here, but nothing I really used. This was um, all my mascara stuff. This is old mascara. The, everything is just kind of like old here that I don't use because I packed every good piece of makeup I had for the trip. Um, this is my only contour I have. Um, fantastic it's not my shade it's very orange and this is actually from target i actually didn't pack this because i got a rare beauty dupe that i packed with me so fantastic and then this was all my lip stuff this is empty this is about to be empty and i didn't pack it this is when would i ever wear this this is just random stuff that i don't wear on an everyday basis because all my everyday products are in punta cana <laughs> so on this fine day, my makeup consists of moisturizer, um, aquaphor, um, expired mascara that I am 99% sure is going to make my eyelashes fall out. This sky high, you know, it's a great mascara, but it's just really, really old. And for my eyebrows, I actually used mascara a little bit to shape them. And darken them just a tad bit because it's so expired there's barely any product on there that it just it can work as an eyebrow shaper thing okay i'm officially ready to go to target to fix my idiot idiotism it is like scorching hot it's not even funny how hot it is right now um i just got it and apparently my name is jessica today so i got an iced caramel macchiato and um a chocolate croissant so it's kind of the go-to order 
I just gotta mix this because it tastes disgusting. Like, it's really bitter like that. I just gotta mix it all in. It's like a little doo doo. <laughs> That's disgusting. worth of things so not ideal but it's okay I mean I replaced everything I guess and I got like makeup wipes and stuff so it was like a few things extra but um I could give you guys a little haul so I'm just gonna show you what I got I'm gonna like try not to wrinkle the bag so I got like makeup wipes the cheapest ones um I bought two brushes to Dominican Republic so I had to replace those because I bought my blush brush and uh, my contour brush, so I had to replace those. Um, I got um, an e.l.f. primer. I got this Too Faced, ooh, I got this Too Faced uh, mascara and an e.l.f. eyebrow pencil and like shaper thing. This thing is like, <sighs> I got this Ulta Beauty like cream bronzer. I got like an e.l.f. lip stain, um, I got, wait, oops, what am I doing? And then for like the base stuff, I got like a BB cream by Maybelline, um, a Maybelline, like this thing, I always use this thing in the shade 115, but like eraser. Um, I got like a bigger, like a perfector eraser and a darker shade to use as like contour because Leah does that and I don't know, I kind of trust what she does because she's like a whole makeup guru at this point. Yes, she is. Um, and then I got like a super stay like Maybelline concealer thing. So, um, a lot of these are new products actually that I have not tried. So I'm just gonna do my whole face of makeup because right now I'm literally just wearing <laughs> expired mascara at this point. So I'm just gonna do my whole face of makeup using these products, and I'll show you guys the results. And I'll see. I'll kind of rate everything and show you what's worth it, what's not. So yeah. So right now, I have to put these products to the test and see if I'm getting my money's worth or not. Um, so I'm going to take you guys along with me to like test out these products. Right now, I'm um, wetting my beauty blender. <laughs> so that's that weird farting noise, literally. Um, I'm kind of excited because these are like new products and I've never used them before. So I want to see if maybe it's a good thing that... I lost my makeup. Well, it's not really a good thing, but maybe it just means I get to try new products. I have all my stuff here, and I'm first gonna start out with using these makeup wipes. I got like a really like off-brand one because they were like two dollars for this. So I got like these makeup wipes that I'm just gonna see. I'm just gonna take off the <laughs> expired, um, expired what's it called mascara that I put on my eyebrows and my eyelashes. I'm now going to try this primer. Um, I already showed Leah all these products and she was very judgy about my choice of products. She said for one that this concealer was or this primer was really bad. So let's just see if it's even as bad as she says because I trust her but to a certain extent because I think everyone's skin is different. So what works for one person may not work for another so we'll just we'll just have to see i just i'm gonna have to see for myself okay this is what it looks like okay it's like really oh it's so light okay it kind of smells weird but i can barely feel it and it oh it feels really soft actually like i can actually like literally not feel it, it just feel like really soft that's such a weird feeling i actually have never put anything on my face like that so let's just keep going next i got this i oh my god i never use a bb cream <laughs> oh my god see my hands are like really like slippery now 
Okay, I never really used a BB cream. Oh, well, great. It's open. Fantastic. Whatever. I never, like, use a BB cream, so let's just see if this does any good. Okay. Maybe it just, like, evens out the skin tone. This, I already know how this is because I, this is, like, my regular go-to concealer um, all the time. So I totally know how this works, but I just can't freaking open anything these days because ugh, my hands are like so slippery now from that uh, primer. Wow, um, I don't know if that's what a primer does, but my face feels really light and refreshed, so maybe that's a good thing. Is something gonna come out? I'm getting impatient, okay. What the flying frick? So you just gotta twist it until it like comes out, I guess. Okay, there we go. Oh my god, that's a lot. I just put it on wherever is necessary. Um, I guess that's blended enough. I'm using my phone as um, a mirror, so... All right. I normally just do like a lighter, more full coverage a concealer at the end just under my eyes and wherever necessary but apparently here because i have like a little birthmark yet that doesn't like to tan no complaints i think everything is blending pretty solidly i don't think i have any complaints my face feels really soft though like it actually does feel really soft thank god i didn't lose this powder um, this is just the L'Oreal powder, and I just put this, like, mainly just where I put the most concealer, kind of. And this I did not take with me to Punta Cana, so this has been saved. And I just, when I put blush on, like, my sister makes fun of me for this, but I just saw, like, a thing on YouTube once that people put it, like, um... It was Haley Fam, and she put it up here, and she said that it just lifts your face. So I've just been doing that forever, and I kind of bring it down a little bit, but mainly just like carry it up. This blush is a uh, brush is really fluffy. I actually really do like it, and it blends really well. And then I have this contour. I actually don't know which one to use. Um. Yeah, I guess first I'm just- I guess I'm just gonna try this one. I actually- It's not really rounded, so... It's just kind of giving me circles right now. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess that's okay. <laughs> okay, that's normally- I normally just- Don't tell me it smells like mocha. Okay, I did get a contour brush because I also left that at Punta Cana. Okay. I love these. I'm going to do my eyebrows with this e.l.f. Instant Lift Brow Pencil. Ah. Um, no complaints there. Works pretty great. Mascara. I had this one, but it was waterproof. My dad brought home Chick fil A, and my parents are texting me to come eat. So I'm gonna try to wrap this up real quick and then ask for their opinion. I'm not even gonna say anything. I just, all I have to do is sit down at the table and see if Le Leah judges. Um, if it looks good, sh frick. If it looks good, she won't say anything. Oh my god. Um, if it looks bad, she'll say something. Ooh, it's cute and small. Okay. I think that is solid. Um, and then I just use this... Elf setting spray. So, I actually did not lose this. I think... <laughs> that scared me, my cat is on my window. I just have to get my hair back to normal, um, act like nothing happened, and see what my sister says. Because my sister has a very brutally honest opinion that everyone takes to heart. So, 
I look very dewy right now. Of course, Leah had something to say, always. But oh, I'm gonna use that. I know, but what? Hold on. It's a little bit. What do you think, though? This is a little it's bit horrible. Jk. Oops. Okay. Seven out of ten. Oh, what's, what's wrong with it? The way you just shook your head. But no, I'm just trying to get my hair back to normal. Um. First of all, the red lip. What is that? Um, um, I was trying out the lip stain. It's gonna fade. It's gonna fade. Um, yeah, that's it. Go. Okay. Well, I like putting on the lip stain because then it just fades and then it kind of just looks really rosy. So, it is no surprise that Leah had something to say, but I don't really care because I actually like it. And I think it came out very, you know, similar to how my makeup normally comes out. Um, I have no complaints, honestly, and I think it gave me a chance to try out some new products, so I'm not really complaining. I like the products, and I do recommend them, so yeah, I don't really, I don't know, I don't really listen to Leah because it's not like her makeup is better because, girl, have you seen Cakey? Because her makeup is Cakey. You're honest, right? Okay, so my makeup has lasted the day. <laughs> the new makeup I got, and I'm here with Libby. So, but at like the boardwalk, and I think it's still intact. I put it on this morning when I got back from Target. Oh my gosh, this hair is like not. So, we got Chick fil A, and, and look at our hat. It's like the snack way. <laughs> <Look him out. laughs> Ah! <laughs> so smart. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for watching. I honestly would not have a video if it weren't for my stupidness at the airport. But um, there's always something, right? So I have a video and um, I regret it, but at the same time, I don't. It's like it could have been worse. Um, I could have left my entire backpack with all my money. So, but I didn't, so that's a plus. <laughs> All right, well, I'll see you guys next week. I have a Punta Cana vlog coming soon, and there will be one on Francesca and Leah, so stay tuned for that. Bye.